Monday, February 11th, and this is Tommy Media's News in 90. I'm Cleo Vrohides. Minnesota Senator Amy Klobuchar announced on February 10th that she is running for president in the 2020 election. The Democratic candidate made her announcement at Boom Island Park in Minneapolis during the snowstorm. Trump responded to Klobuchar's announcement with a tweet mocking her stance on global warming, a phenomenon he has disputed in the past. Klobuchar is among four other Democrats who have announced their campaign. A 16-year-old boy was arrested after he briefly took control of a small plane during a short commercial flight over western Alaska, authorities said. The teen was in front of the passenger seat of the flight from Napakiak to Bethel. The teen grabbed the air aircraft controls shortly after takeoff, causing the plane to enter a steep climb and then a dive toward the ground. Alaska state troopers said a woman sitting behind the teen grabbed him around the neck, pulling him away from the controls. The pilot stabilized the aircraft and returned to Napakiak. The airline will continue to allow passengers to sit in the front seat, he said. Women in rap triumphed at the Grammys on Sunday as female acts took home top prizes, including Album of the Year and Best New Artist. Rap artist Childish Gambino made history when his hit This Is America became the first rap-based track to win Record and Song of the Year. Six women were nominated for Best New Artist, and five of the eight Album of the Year nominees were women, including Brandi Carlile. Cardi B also made history as the first solo female to win Best Rap Album. For Tommy Media, I'm Cleo Rohides.